Hello everybody. Second video very similar to the, the last one. I'm trying to make a shorter version just for the tip. The other one had uh, me asking some questions. Hoping you experts take a look at that video and uh, help me figure out what's wrong with my car. Uh, but this video is just to show the little hack I figured out. If you want to test a new Opti before you put it in the car, before you go through all that trouble. Now this is the one that came off this car. Got a new one on, but all the aftermarket ones you have a lot of issues. And you just want to check for your... Uh, your waveforms so you got your oscilloscope to test for waveforms you hook it up to the white wire going into the ICM here above the coil that's where you get your signal from the Opti it goes through the computer and then over to here you know those good square waveforms uh, lots of information online how to figure that out but you want to test uh, the, the new one you're going to put on because there's nothing worse than replacing the Opti and the new one giving you problems well here's how you can test it just over here at the harness where you would uh, unplug the one that's on the car. Plug in the spare wire which is going to this Opti on a drill. Turn the ignition on. Pull the fuse for the uh, so you don't just spray gas into the engine while it's not running. And just spin the drill. You'll get some nice pretty waveforms here that uh, if you know how to interpret you can tell if your uh, Opti's good before you put it back on or not. Or if it's in a junkyard Opti you bought. You want to test the sensor. There's a way to do it. So there you go. Quick and easy way to test your Opti. You just need an oscilloscope, but that's, you're going to need that regardless. It's 80 bucks on eBay and it's worth that to avoid the headache of having to do this job multiple times. Uh, so if you want to test it before you put it in, there you go. Alright everybody, have a good day.